In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Telegram this group can't be displayed because it was used to spread issue. Now, in order to fix this, what we need to do is we need to access Telegram on a web browser. And we could do this on either a mobile device or on a desktop. Now, for this video, I'm just going to be working with my phone really quickly. And basically, what you want to do is you want to open up a web browser like Google, for example. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and look up Telegram login just like so. Then you want to go to the official link over here that says Telegram web. So please go ahead and select on that. Now, if you never access Telegram on the web before, it is going to ask you to log in. So please go ahead and do that. Anyways, guys, once you're done with that, all you want to do is you want to go to the top left and select on these three bars just like so. Then from here, you want to go ahead and select on settings. Then you want to scroll down a little bit until you see this option that does say privacy and security. So go ahead and press on that. Then from here, all you want to do is you want to keep on scrolling more and eventually you will see this option that does say sensitive content and you want to make sure that this is actually turned on. So please go ahead and check it and make sure that, you know, it is actually turned on. All right. Now, another thing that you guys could do is go back to the Telegram application. And what you want to do is you want to look for the nice gram bot. So let's go ahead and do that. Nice. And then gram bot right over here. And basically this is a bot that will allow you to turn off any restrictions and allow you to fix this error. So go ahead and follow all the instructions over here in the nice gram bot. What you guys could also do as sort of a final resort is to create a brand new Telegram account. So to do this, you will need to log out of your current Telegram account and then create a new account using a different phone number, preferably from a country with fewer restrictions, and then go ahead and see if that does work. But if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial.